Hey guys, Rusty Myers here and dude just went to the store. Big party tonight. Trump's in North Carolina. Granny, why are you leaving the door open again? Seriously, the AC's on. Also, Granny, they said that, you know, you can't refill your tram at all two days early. Granny? Gr oh, sweet baby Trump. Granny, 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 wake up. No. Oh, no. Yes, I need the police and an ambulance. I came into my house. My granny's on the floor. It smells like socialism in here. The Bible verses have been ripped off the wall. You know, I don't think she's dead. She always smells like poop. Hey, guys. Rusty Myers here. And, dude, this is how quickly it can happen. A situation just like that. Okay, you you go out to Walmart, you know, pick up a prescription, you know, pick it up early or whatever. And you come in, the door's ajar, and there's your granny. And she got beat up by a socialist or like a liberal, you know, libertard. So, guys, here's the thing. Um, Trump's poll numbers are really down. And I'm not saying I'm panicking, but I'm prepared to vote twice again like I did in 2016. Oh, everything's fine, granny. Everything's fine. Yeah, I was just shooting a video, you know, helping conservatives so we can make sure, you know, Trump gets reelected again. Okay, leave me a tram it all out. Love you too, granny. Um... So, guys, we need to start setting liberals up, you know, like saying, like, say you go, like, like even, don't, I'm not above this. Like, say your boss is an annoying liberal, okay? Trump poll numbers are down. He might lose in 2020. It's looking like it. So, it, liberals can't vote if they're in jail, okay? So, say you're working at Walmart and you got that annoying, you know, woman that thinks she's, you know, urban, you know, smoking Newport. She comes up to you and is like, hey, make sure you get your work done. You're like, excuse me. I didn't appreciate you touching me. As a matter of fact, I don't feel safe. Matter of fact, I can't take this. And you call the cops and say she tried to touch you or something. You know, like next to the canoes or, you know, in the sports section by the basketballs. No one can hear you scream. Something like that, you know. Um, or, you know, just like, I, this is what I like to do. You know, go to church and, you know, the janitor at our church is a little, you know, crazy, I think. So, you know, just get him to leave the doors open. Come in there, like spray paint a bunch of, you know, resists or Trump sucks or Obama rules and then just blame it on liberals. Tell the cops like, oh man, I was just in here worshiping the Lord and these crazy, you know, freaking radical socialists came in here and for a minute there when they looked at me, you know, I was, I, I, I was afraid for my life. You know, I felt like a minority on a traffic stop. You know, or you know, something the cops can relate to. You know, we are in the South. So something like that, because guys, we have to make sure Trump gets reelected, okay? Because, you know, it's it's not good. So we gotta make sure that we get liberals out of the picture. Because, you know, yes, Trump's chosen by God, but sometimes you have to do God's work.